。我哋惯用平价代表低价，贵价代表高价，英文分分钟会犯错。好似 the price is cheap。The price is dear， 兩句都係唔通嘅。Cheap 咧即係唔使好多錢先買得到啦。相反 ，dear 即係要好多錢先買得到。但我哋買嘅係貨物，並非價錢，因此 cheap price、dear price 都係唔通嘅。講價錢一定要講高低，要講 the price is low、the price is high、low price、high price。有教師見過學生咁樣寫 ，his business made his wealth richer。大概譯住中文呢一句，佢嘅生意令到佢財富更加富有，中英都好曳，要咁樣改法。His business made him richer， 佢嘅生意令到佢更富有，或者 His business increased his wealth， 佢嘅生意增加佢嘅財富。富有嘅係個人，唔係財富。Rich 呢個形容詞係形容個人，唔係形容 wealth。由今日兩個例睇到咧，措辭或者修辭咧。好多時係邏輯問題，中英都一樣。無論中英修辭都係要求簡潔明快。如果有得選擇嘅咧，用動詞唔好用名詞，尤其是抽象名詞。如果有一個字用到嘅，就唔好用多字嘅同義片語。睇兩個例。The appointment of a new manager will be made by the board next Tuesday。嗱呢個裏邊有 appointment 就係名詞啦。而家用動詞啦 ，a new manager will be appointed by the board next Tuesday。第二個例 ，we hope to give consideration to your request in the near future。呢句經常咁樣譯法嘅，我哋希望喺不久將來對你嘅要求加以考慮。無論中英都唔係好句嚟嘅，先改英文嗰句，用一個字代替幾個字 ，consider 代替咗 give consideration to。用 soon 代替 in the near future， 成句就變成 We hope to consider your request soon。中文跟住變為我哋希望盡快考慮你嘅要求。有啲學生認為 in the near future 好過 soon 一個字，咁嘅想法完全錯誤。About a preposition 可以理解為 on the subject of, in connection with。On the question of, in relation to, with reference to， 通通等於中文嘅關於。如果話我讀過一篇關於健康嘅文章，英語可以咁樣講 ：I read an article on the subject of health。可以將 on the subject of 化為 on the question of, in relation to。但係點樣變都不如 I read an article about health， 或者 I read an article on health。有好多人寫生葉信。成日都唔用一個字，用幾個字去代替，滿以為咁樣咧就表現出所謂商業格局。咁嘅想法錯得好緊要。睇兩個例 ，We are not in a position to supply the goods immediately。呢一個就不如 We are unable to supply the goods immediately。我哋唔能夠即時交貨。I'm writing on behalf of Mr. Chan。呢一個就不如 I'm writing for Mr. Chan。代陳先生執筆。Awful 本來嘅意思咧就係可怕，當俗語有兩種作用。第一咧就係任何唔好嘅事都係 awful 噶啦，等於 frightful、dreadful、terrible， 好似 awful weather 壞嘅天氣。I feel awful， 我覺得好唔妥當。第二點咧就係根本冇意思嘅，係過嚟加強語氣而用嘅。好似 that's an awful lot of money， 好多錢噃。I'm in an awful hurry， awful hurry 等於 great hurry。講到彭定康，有日喺沙田同啲記者閒談，嗰陣時話：我哋食咗好多乳鴿啊。英語就係呢一句 ：We had an awful lot of pigeon。We had an awful lot of pigeon。嗱，如果你學佢咧，有兩點要注意。第一，唔好將個 awful 擺錯地方。如果話 we had a lot of awful pigeon 就弊啦，變咗我哋食咗好多難食嘅鴿。第二點咧就係語言好似衣服咁，一定要視乎場合同對象而定嘅。彭定康咧就因為想平易近人同人談談嗰陣時候就用俗語，但論證嗰陣時候措辭好高雅得體嘅。俗語副詞 awfully 又係一啲可怕嘅意思都冇，只有加強語氣嘅作用，即如。I'm awfully sorry， 等於 I'm very sorry。除咗 awfully， 仲有 frightfully、terribly、dreadfully 等等嘅字，即如 It's frightfully kind of you。The price is terribly high。This is dreadfully expensive。呢啲咁嘅俗語咧，我哋要學
。但係寫論文或者商業信嗰陣時候咧，就要避免咁嘅浮誇字眼，一定要採用啲比較平實啲嘅言辭，即使 extremely、immensely、tremendous、immeasurable 呢啲字都要唔好亂咁用，好似 we are。Extremely sorry， 不如 we are very sorry。We are immensely pleased， 不如 we are very pleased。There are tremendous problems， 不如 there are great problems。The storm caused immeasurable damage to the factory， 不如 the storm caused heavy damage to the factory。中文都係啊，唔好動不動話無可估計。